surfing this well, it's hard to imagine Cam Davis is just 10 years old. I got semifinals today. Got six man semifinals, so, and then I got maybe finals tomorrow. Davis is just one of nearly 170 surfers at the 15th annual Guy Daniels Memorial Surf Off, a competition that's seen a huge increase in the number of participants from last year. 50 more this year, even with the rain. Director Mikey Pruitt says the reason for the increase is organizers moved the surf off two weeks earlier than years past. And this year we decided um, that we should try to get the contest a little earlier in the, in the year, uh, just by a few weeks so we could capture the visitors to our area. We have a lot of, a lot of tourists that come and stay and uh, our plan was to capture some of their attention and get them to have a good time along with us. And they are. But for Davis, that doesn't usually happen until he actually starts to surf. And nervousness transforms to excitement and adrenaline. When I get in the water, it all goes away. The event is not only a learning process for up-and-coming surfers like Daniels, but also an event that remembers the life of one as well. Guy Daniels was a gifted surfer himself, who died in 1999 of a heart condition at the age of 19. Through his foundation and the surf competition, students have received more than $60,000 in scholarships. Kids that are really motivated to do something in their, in their community, in their lives, or with their family, um, and those kids some need a chance. Some of them just need help, and I hope our $1,000 helps and uh, we want to eventually give more. This year, 10 students will receive scholarships through the foundation. In Surfside Beach, Mark Liverman, WPDE News Channel 15.